first dentist. Today on Echoes Through Time channel, we'll journey to ancient Egypt. Millennia ago, on the banks of the majestic Nile River, within the heart of ancient Egypt, thrived a civilization that astounded the world with its monumental achievements and profound wisdom. Amidst the sands of time, the ancient Egyptians developed not only a grand civilization, but also an incipient yet significant understanding of medicine and dentistry. In the dawn of 2600 BC, amidst the shadows of temples and pyramids, the Egyptians faced the pains and ailments afflicting their bodies, including the maladies plaguing their precious teeth. Among them arose a prominent figure, a man whose name would echo through the ages, Hesira, the first documented dentist in history. Hesira was not only a physician in the pharaoh's court, but also revered as the chief of physicians and the court dentist. His tomb, discovered in the necropolis of Saqqara by the French Egyptologist Auguste Mariette in the 1860s, stands as a testament to his esteemed position and the high value attributed to him in Egyptian society. The discovery of Hesira's tomb provided invaluable insight into life and medical practices in ancient Egypt. Furthermore, Hesira's burial site near the Pyramid of Djoser, the pharaoh of the Third Dynasty, was no coincidence. Djoser reigned from 2667 to 648 BCE during the period of the Old Kingdom of Egypt. Being buried near the pharaoh was an honor reserved for those who enjoyed great respect and prestige in Egyptian society, ensuring a prominent position in the afterlife. With rudimentary tools but skilled hands, Hesira and other Egyptian dentists practiced advanced treatments for their time. They used levers and forceps to extract painful teeth and treat cavities, applying vegetable resins or tar to fill cavities and halt the progression of disease. Gum ulcers were treated with mixtures of terebinth resin, cow's milk, dates, dry carob pods, and other plants. Applied locally or first chewed and then spat out. Additionally, the Egyptians developed methods to maintain oral health. Wooden or metal toothpicks were used to clean teeth, while abrasive powders of pumice stone polished their smiles. These practices reflect an early but significant understanding of the importance of dental hygiene in preventing dental diseases. In the court chambers and in the village homes, the figure of Hesira transcended the mere trade of a healer. He was a symbol of wisdom and prestige, whose legacy was preserved in the inscriptions of his tomb and in the memory of a civilization seeking cures for the ailments of body and soul. Thus. Among the secrets buried in the desert sands lies the story of Hesura and the early steps of dentistry in the heart of ancient Egypt, a tale that endures as a beacon of light in the vast ocean of time. Subscribe for more videos.